Guys, I've been um, dying to open this for for ages, and um, it's it's a sealed survival tin. Um, and I just thought it was a, a good opportunity. I'm gonna. This is a like a commercial version of a survival tin or a rescue tin. Um, and I thought I'd just break out what I would use. And this has just been sat in the car in the glove compartment for for months. And um, and it's got some goodies in it. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna crack her open. And I'll show you exactly what there is in the tin. I don't know whether or not we can focus all right on that. But um, to start off with, it, it tells me the first product. Now, this is packed in America. So um, I would assume that most of my American subscribers would be familiar with the first product. And I don't know whether or not I'm pronouncing it properly. But it's Astaminophen. Um, it's a... Uh, it's a painkiller, so it's got one of those in there first. And then the next, it says we've got um, an adhesive bandage, alcohol prep, antibiotic ointment, book of matches, tea bag, chewing gum, compass, sugar, whistle, salt packet, energy nugget or nougat, duct tape, fire starter cube, wire clip, First aid instructions, we've then got a fish hook and line, notepad, pencil, razor blade, safety pin, signal mirror, and waterproof bag. And that's all in this. Looks like a sardine tin. So without further ado, I'm going to crack her open for the first time and we'll see exactly what we've got in there. Right, take the lid off. Okay, so we've got some instructions here with a big paper clip. So I'm assuming that's our waterproof bag to start off with. Book of matches. What have we got? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 20 box safety matches. Okay. Survival kit contents, also a good bit of tinder. Um, what else have we got on there? When you're up against it, stop, sit, think, observe, plan. Good advice, I like that. Right, I'll put the details at the, um, the bottom of the, 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 the description. Um, once I've finished, once I've uploaded the video. Okay, contents, first aid, yeah. Bit of first aid advice. I would advise you to learn first aid before you start going out and venturing out on your own. Bit of duct tape, okay, they weren't joking there. It is a bit. Paper clip. Okay, alcohol wipe. There you go, aspirin. We've got two aspirin tablets there. Then we've got a triple antibiotic ointment there. That's pretty good. Lipton tea. Ooh, full of antioxidants. Nice cup of, cup of tea there. I was going to say a cup of Rosie Lee or a cup of char. Bit of salt, iodized salt. <laughs> Tootsie Roll. No survival kit would be a survival kit without a Tootsie Roll. I nearly missed that. There's a hook there. Nappy pin or safety pin. Button compass. That. That is, um, I'd say that's a, a fire lighting block. That's what it looks like. We've got a razor blade. We've got sugar to go with our tea. Some Wrigley's chewing gum. Happy days. Um, bit of cotton line. Twine. Pencil to 
grab a bit of paper and a single plaster whistle and a tin so there we go that's the outdoor rescue tin trademark so that's a, a commercial survival tin um, and I think next time I'll show you I've got a couple that are just you know kicking about a little you know a little mint tin is it um, is it the Altoids tin and a little tobacco tin similar size to that maybe a little bit bigger certainly got more stuff in it but that is a commercial survival tin courtesy of um, the outdoor rescue tin right then guys I opened it up I've been dying to do that for ages so there you go thanks for your time god bless and um, the next one I show you will be you know mine all right cheerio bye